Hey everybody, Shibi here. Are you running all over your valley like a crazy person trying to find a festive fugu or anglerfish? Well, I got you. This video is going to show you how to very easily get your hands on those fish so you can finish your festive duty. If you don't know what the heck I'm talking about or what a festive duty is and you're somehow on this video, check out this video that I made of a master guide of all the five festive duties and how to complete them. I'm sure that you're aware that you have to catch one of each of the five festive fish in your collection. The collection does show you where they spawn, but it likes to leave out the details. Thankfully, most items in the game don't have a a special set of circumstances but a few of them do. I don't know why the collection doesn't show them or if they're gonna change that. It's kind of annoying as a player. The only reason that I've grown to like it is because as a youtuber it makes you have to come find me. <laughs> one extremely important fact is that only one of each kind of festive fish will spawn per day. So if you want to collect a bunch of them make sure you bring a fishing friend along with you when you fish the red and green spots. We know that anglerfish are gonna be in the forgotten lands but what you might not know is that they apparently only spawn from 6 p.m. to 9 a.m. Remember that's going to be to your local device time and it's really not recommended to time travel. Festive fugu can be caught at any time during the day, but it has to be raining or storming. The same goes for regular fugu, and it's the only one that's been missing from my collection because I just haven't fished a gold spot when it's raining. So thank you to this commenter, the new kid, who let me know that you have to catch it when it's raining. And the Disney Dreamlight Valley Discord confirmed it for me this morning that this does in fact work with the festive ones as well. If you're like me, your game is just never freaking raining. I've been waiting all day and I just haven't seen any rain. But of course, as soon as my girlfriend hopped on, it was raining for her, so enjoy this clip of her getting a festive fugu while I'm suffering. Some more information you might be curious about. Now for me, all the festa bubbles were just there as soon as I went to the locations. Remember, they should only spawn once per day according to the Discord. If for some reason one of them is not there for you, you haven't caught them already and it's not the angler or fugu where it has these special circumstances, you might need to fish some of the other spots to make them spawn. I didn't have that problem, they were just sitting there for me. But that should be everything that you need to know about the festive fish. If I'm missing any information, please comment it down below so other people can get caught up. Also, side note, the ho-ho-ho wrapping paper is spawning in the plaza. Apparently, like one to two pieces spawn every one to two hours, which originally we thought that it was going to be one to two pieces per day. I have not confirmed this yet, but I was able to pick up two pieces from my plaza, and I will tell you that one of them was stuck in a piece of my furniture. So I highly recommend going into furniture mode and zooming around if you're struggling to find something. That's also how I found Stitch's third sock today. If you need any help on any of the festive duties, Stitch's socks, or anything like that, you can check out my channel. I have videos on all of that stuff. And don't forget, you can still do almost all of the Halloween duties as well. You did not miss them. There's only one that you can't do, and I have a video on that as well. Also, if you're wondering why I didn't have a clip of the anglerfish in this video, it's because they just came out today and I'm posting this well before 6 p.m. I don't want to wait hours of people waiting and suffering, running back and forth on their beach trying to find a fugu when it's not raining, so I just want to post this as soon as possible. But I will be getting mine right around 6 p.m. tonight and I hope that you're able to too. I do kind of hate when they like time lock certain items because it's like some people have jobs or obligations where they like literally can't get on the game during those hours. So I'm sorry if that happens to you. Hopefully they do something better about it in the future. I think it makes a lot more sense to either have it where it's like raining in the game or if it's like a certain amount of days apart like Stitch's sock. I think that makes more sense. Anyways, I hope this video helped you out. Make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you're new. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a really good rest of your day.